Would you like to convert your submissions into PDF documents? Let me show you how. Hey, Jotformers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly, and as you can see, I'm currently in the desktop version of my dashboard, and converting your submissions into PDFs can be very beneficial for you, and there's actually a lot of things that we can do within this realm. So let me show you a few of the highlights. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose my expense reimbursement. I'm going to hover over it so the entire thing highlights. We're going to choose more, and then I'm going to open the PDF editor. Now, upon first glance, this looks really basic. So if you would like to level this up to fit your branding, we can do that right here within the PDF editor. So over on the left hand side, if we want to add in a heading, we can drag in a heading. If we want to bring in an image, maybe it is your company's logo, we can have this fit into our company branding. Now, some other things that we can bring in that currently aren't a part of the form, over on the left-hand side, we have these different form elements. So we can bring in our form title right here, or maybe we want that to be our heading right up here. So we can go ahead and get rid of this heading right here. Now we can also bring in our submission date, which is also right here, but maybe we wanna put it somewhere else in this PDF. We can also bring in the submission ID, and if for any reason we need their IP address, we can drag that in as well. And if you are utilizing the approval process, we have the approval status and the activity history, which would already be in the PDF, but again, if we want to add it in somewhere else further down in this PDF, we can do that as well. Then at the top on the left-hand side, we have the different form fields. Again, if we need to bring these in maybe somewhere else, Within this PDF, we can bring in all these three, the name, the email, and then of course this expense reimbursement amount. Now from here, if we want to send this PDF to someone, all we need to do is come up here to the top right-hand corner, we can click send. We can send them the link to view this, or we can send it as an attachment within our email right here. And of course, before we hit send, we can edit this as well. Now, if we want to print, we can hit the print button. And if we wanna download every single one of these submissions as a PDF, we can click right here. It's going to download, it's gonna put it in the bottom left-hand side of my screen once it is done, right down here. But it is as simple as that. If you have other questions about converting your submissions into PDFs, definitely check out our landing page that has a ton of other help articles. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel and turn on that bell to get notification every time we put out a new video. I'll see you next time.